already the endometrioma. Uh, when I was experiencing symptoms symptoms of endometriosis and they got really, really bad, this started it started getting really, really, really bad for me in 2016. And what I mean by that was it wasn't only impacting me during my period anymore. It was impacting me every day in my life in many different ways at this point. Um, I dealt with really severe, 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 such bad period pain on the left side. Every time I got my period, it was like, it was like labor. It was like contraction pains, but it was like this deep stabbing pain on this left side. And it's very common in endometriosis for disease to be found on the left side. Like it's more common on the left side. So that's weird. But, um, when I had surgery, I didn't even think to explain to my doctor, like before surgery that I, that the symptoms I was experiencing were possibly related to a cyst. Um, because I had been experiencing it for so long, it kind of like became like this normal thing. And it was all enveloped with all of this, these other symptoms and all this other pain that I was experiencing. So my surgeon actually didn't know I had an endometrioma going into surgery. And so what happened was when I was in surgery, when my surgeon was trying to um, go about how he was going to remove the endometrioma, which is the appropriate um, kind of treatment, um, for the complexity of what these are, um, it actually burst. So my endometrioma burst during the surgery, which I'm sure made removal and cleanup a lot more difficult than it needed to be. But when I woke up, uh, from surgery, I had told my surgeon just before, like right before, and this was, I was struggling with infertility. I had never been pregnant in my life, like accidentally or anything, but my husband and I had been trying to actively conceive for a couple of years at this point. And I told my surgeon last minute, I said, if the choice is between saving an organ for it to be for reproductive purposes or improving my quality of life. I want you to choose to improve my quality of life. I don't want you to save that organ if you think it's going to continue to cause me problems. So when my endometrioma burst, um, the decision was made because of the health of that left ovary that the endometrioma was on, that that left ovary also needed to be removed. When my when I woke up from surgery and my husband told me this, I legitimately did not believe him because he jokes about everything. I thought he was lying. And I, I had a hard time.